Hi guys, what's up? I know it's been a while since I last made a video, but this is something a little different. Um, I don't know if many, I, I don't know if any YouTubers at all do this, but if so, then cool. But if not, then I might be the first one to do this. Um, I'm going to be start talking about my high school days. Yep, that's right. I'm going to be taking you back to the time I was in high school. Um... And what you're seeing right here in front of me is my high school graduation cap, as well as the tassel. So, yeah, let's get started, shall we? Okay, so, I started high school in, like, almost nine, like, nine years ago. Um, I started in August of 2008. Um... Let me just say this. Going to high school, it was, like, pretty scary for me. As, well, I know freshman year is very, um, you know, scary because, you know, it was a big adjustment from middle school to high school. Um, so on my very first day, um, I was scared and I didn't really have any friends. At least until my second week of freshman year. Um, where I met Michael Schomer. Shout out to you. Shout out to you, Michael, if you're watching this. Um, you've been a great friend to me since hi throughout high school, and I'm glad we're also friends on YouTube as well. Um, but anyways, it was pretty hard, you know? Like, having to, like, know my way around the school and stuff. But I, I had some help from my sisters and cousins. Because they went to that, because they went to the same high school. Because they went, they were in high school together, so there's that. Um, freshman year wasn't easy because, um, well, for one, you're new, so. I got picked on by upperclassmen, and, um, but I think they were just doing that to be funny and stuff. Um, one of the upperclassmen, like juniors and seniors, one of the, one of my friends was actually a senior. Actually, no, two of my friends were seniors. Um, they graduated in 2009. So, I was still a, so, you know. So, 2008 to 2009 was my freshman year. And during my freshman year, um, I also, one of my, one of my friends also, like, scared me. And... I had like this Yahoo chocolate drink or Yoohoo, whatever you call it. I don't know. Um, I, he flinched. He made me flinch, and that and that Yahoo chocolate drink spilled all over me. So yeah, that was freshman year. Moving on to sophomore year, which is 2010. So um, yeah, sophomore year was t my soft. Moving on to sophomore year, 2010. Sophomore year was a little better for me because, um, well, I was like, you know, out of that freshman year, out of that freshman year phase and into sophomore year. Um, nothing really changed my sophomore year. Um, one of the things I do remember about high school was the, the lunch menu. I remember, like, obviously going back to freshman year, um... I, um, actually, wait, before I go on more about sophomore year, I have another friend whose name is Erin Blim. She was a senior. I was a freshman. So, shout out to you, Erin, if you're watching this. So, anyway, moving, so anyway, going back to sophomore year, what I remember most about the sophomore year was, I think the lunch menu, um, and, um, they had whipped potatoes, whipped, sorry, whipped potatoes, and tossed salad. Now, some people thought that that was just disgusting. But, hey, you know, it's a high school lunch menu. What can you do? Um, and speaking of cafeteria food, every morning I would always get one, I would always get the Boston Cream Filled Donut and that Yahoo drink, and it would cost me $2.10. I used to get those every morning. So, anyways, 
back to sophomore year. Sophomore year is where I also met Tweaky BNSF. Um, and we're still friends to this day. So, Tweaky BNSF, if you're watching this, shout out goes to you, man. You're, you know. So, yeah, that's, so yeah, my sophomore year, I'd say fall of sophomore year. Yes, fall of 2010 was my sophomore year. And, of course, that's where I met Twiggy BNSF. Um, other than that, nothing much has changed. Um, now, now moving on to junior year. I was, um, moving on to junior year. Oh, and if you're wondering, I didn't go to any proms or, or events my freshman and sophomore year. Um... But anyways, moving on to junior year. Now, junior year is where things really got fun. I was now an upperclassman. Um, so, um, after that, um, of course I turned 16 that year, and that's when I got my very first iPhone. So anyways, my, so anyways, fall of junior year, 2011. Um, I remember this the most because of Homecoming Week. Homecoming Week is typically in October. September or October, depending on how you look at it. Um, now, let me go into the, you know, um, you know, for Homecoming Day, for Homecoming Week. Um, I'll go through the, like, the days that, what I remember. Um, Monday would be Lazy Monday, I think, or Pajama Day. It's where you would just wear your PJs or paj or sweatpants to school. Tuesday was Toga Tuesday. It's where all the seniors, and I think juniors as well, wore togas. Wednesday was Color Day. At least I think it was Color Day. Now let me go into Color Day specifically, because Color Day was my favorite day of homecoming week. Now, freshmen wear, now if you're a freshman, you have to wear red. If you were a sophomore, you had to wear green. If you were a junior, you had to wear yellow. And if you were a senior, you had to wear orange. Um, um, the staff were blue, I believe. I think it was blue. And parents wear black. There's, um, on color day, this, um... It's just amazing, and if you try to get, like, colored, like, with markers and stuff, you had to tell the dean or student, you had to tell, like, a nearby staff member right away. And the senior sit-downs, or sit-ins, it's when the seniors block the hallways on purpose. Um, but what I loved most about, but what I loved about most about color day was night games, especially when all the classes compete against each other. And there's also the bonfire. Now, those were amazing. I love the bonfire. Um, bonfires were just amazing to me. I went to one my junior year, but I but I posed as a senior. But I was actually posing as a senior. Even though I was actually a junior, I just did that to be funny. But anyways, um, so yeah, 2012 or so, I think, whatever, I don't know. But yeah. Um, so yeah, that was junior year. I took P.E., you know. Um, one of the gym teachers I had was Mr. Miller, Mr. Timothy W. Miller. He was a cool teacher, um, although he was strict. Um, I liked him, you know, he was cool. So, yeah. So that was junior year, 2011. And now, on to senior year, 2012. Um, of course, um, senior year, of course, was my final year of high school, and nothing really much, nothing much happened, you know? There was the senior donut party, but there was that. Um, I, ho however, I did get to go to prom, you know? And that was actually my first and fun, that was actually my very last time going to prom. So... Well, not senior year. I didn't go my senior year. And now, moving on to super senior year. 
Now, I know what you're thinking. Wait, if you were a senior in 2012, you, sh you should have graduated by then. Well, yeah, I should have, but the thing is, I decided to stay a fifth year because I wasn't ready to leave high school yet, which is why I'm... Which is why I'm class of 2013. Um, so, yeah. And I, I was also in special ed for, the, for all four, five years. Four to five years. Um, during my fifth super senior year, I was manager of the girls track and field team, which is great. Um, and a whole bunch of other things as well that happened. Um, I did Special Olympics. I, um... I did Special Olympics and some other things as well. Um, and of course, prom. And then, graduation. My prom was amazing. Our, my prom ended like at 3 a.m. And I was home by 4. So yeah. And then, graduation day. So, yeah. That's, um, that's basically my life of high school. Um... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, give it a thumbs up so that I know you like it. And comment down below on what your favorite comment down below on what your favorite high school memory was if you went to my high school. Oh, and Michael Schomer and Twiggy BNSF. If you guys are watching this, shout out goes to you guys. This is Sodor Santa Fe Fan94 signing off, and I hope you've enjoyed.